So this is a little fun one you can do with uh, the self-feedback resonance of Filter Freak, one or two, it doesn't really matter, to get that kind of really cool sonogram style uh, sound, which is sometimes hard to record, and you can come up with some cool variations by just tweaking the knobs to get all kinds of different cool uh, styles. And you don't need any samples or anything, you just uh, get Filter Freak, either one, uh, turn the resonance all the way up. It's not activated yet. And then I think I have the yeah, output down a little bit. And then uh, you can change the shapes. Some might not work. And then the pulse maxed out is nice. Again, you can experiment. And then when I activate it, we're going to get that really low. So you can use any any frequency really low but let's start with the really the really really low low you can barely hear it and then we're going to activate this flanger we're not going to hear a lot of difference until we get to to the next few plugins but the flanger will do a lot later a little distortion to kind of give it some texture um, this little guy starts adding the motion and then the phase distortion is where we really get the maxed, almost maxed out drive. Can change the, and then I'd like to put a filter after. Clean it up a little bit. That low end is not necessary. The high end is not necessary. Um, and then just by using this. Uh, the tone can change a lot, kind of add texture, kind of grit, kind of kind of chill it out a little bit, a little bit. That little distorted peak is what kind of makes it feel like a real sonogram. They always kind of distort at the peak. Uh, then Mondo Mod can control a bit of your speed. You can use this one or and then uh, distortion again will change a lot of how it feels. Flanger, I think this feedback adds a lot. Feels a little cleaner, a little more purry. I like, and then you maybe we can try like a Try to align the rhythm. But yeah, you can basically play with these controls forever, even just uh, the filter freak level, changing the frequency.
yeah you can play with with this kind of thing forever and uh maybe i didn't go through the mondo mod uh but yeah you want it spinning the whole way full range of 360 bring the center uh down you can play with these amplitude at max and find the speed that you like with a nice saw wave everything else is pretty much kind of interchangeable flangers distortions phase distortion i think is a pretty cool one for how it affects the um, and then have some recenter and some you know uh limiter to to clean it up but yeah it's a pretty fun one